Um, All right, everybody, start to shut up. So, <gasps> ow! Oh my God. Oh. <laughs> oh my God. I made this Heather puppet. <laughs> there you go. Little weather origami. For sure, could have been done by serial killer. <laughs> I didn't want to say that. <laughs> There are a lot of streaming services out there these days, but today we celebrate NBC Universal's newest, Peacock. It's really everyone's favorite kind of streaming service. It's free. You got free television. You got free movies. The stories that you love and the stories that you have yet to discover. Today, some of the biggest names from Peacock programming will be dropping in on their unsuspecting fans to get to know them a little better. Now, let's say you're a fan of AP Bio. All right, everybody, let's go ahead and start to shut up now. NBC's hit comedy, recently renewed for its third season. We'd love to see it right on Peacock. But not just a fan, like a super fan. You know, the kind that makes art projects about their favorite characters. Thank you so much for coming to this AP Bio fan art crafting class. This is the most human interaction I've had, I think, in the last two weeks. What if we wanted to reward these diehard fans by having their favorite characters crash the party? Mr. Griffin. Oh, Ralph, you snuck up on me. Cotton, how you doing, buddy? I'm good, man. How are you? Sheltering in place. We are going to craft a neck brace using fun crafting materials you can have at home. Give yourself an index finger's worth of space and draw a line, and that's what'll give it that curve. Yeah. Um, All right, everybody, start to shut up. Oh, snap. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> really? <laughs> Holy crap. I just peed my pants a little bit. Patton and I are here now an oh. AP Bio's crafting club, and you all found each other. That's so beautiful. <laughs> what this is for Patton and I is just a massive ego boost. Absolutely, uh, <laughs> yes. As fragile, unstable men, thank you. <laughs> yes. What do you got, guys? What do you got? I made this Heather puppet. <laughs> Whoa, wait. Can I just get video of you? I don't know if I have a great Heather voice. Oh, good. There it is. Hey, boy, you're smooth like butter dripping off of chocolate. The butter will run off uh, chocolate on your body and leave a hot, sticky mess. <laughs> Bravo! I made, like, a serial killer version of it. <laughs> um, and it got oh words from the magazine. You were trying to embrace the creepy serial killer font, but your crafting instincts took over. This serial killer has really good like font and layout skills. Yeah, yeah, I'm not just gonna slap it together. I'm gonna, I want it to stand out. One of your parting words was, you over there, read something from a book, you with the glasses. And then everyone started reading, right? You know how when people collect teeth for their kill? So I figured I would make a collar that you would wear because you would go out on your dates with this and say, you know what? These are the students that have succumbed to my lashings. Like the predator with his, with his ear. <laughs> Absolutely. Now I got a question for you. You are insanely ripped. <laughs> <laughs> what is that piece of exercise equipment there? This is a treadmill that folds up and I, I hate treadmills. My dog runs on this. Is your dog yeah, ripped? Uh, it's a miniature schnauzer. I could get him. You want me to wake him up? I love how you looked up. Like, he's got a bedroom upstairs. Like, he, like <laughs> <laughs> Here's a crystal neck brace. Karen, beautiful. Yeah. Also, little serial killer. Again, I hate to hate oh. keep bringing that up, but it does look like something a serial killer would make. 10,000%. Well, I mean, the thing about crafting in general is it's so repetitive that there is an inherently psychotic element to it. Like, yes. you have to be a psycho to just put a bunch of crystals on a thing. You have to be, they, like, there's something not okay. How deep does you guys' fandom go? I have a matching tattoo with my husband of Joey Tribbiani. And it says, <laughs> Fabulous. And it says what? I'll be there for you. Now we can't get divorced because who's gonna date us with this? <laughs> Uh, getting a tattoo of Pat and I is a, is a great way to narrow down your options. Oh, yes. That oh, really yeah. 
kind of shuts the lens down. One of my favorite episodes is when we meet Lynette. So I made the get the chair back chalkboard. This is actually all 100% biology. Mm. And it's not a crazy plan to get my chair back. Although it does say right there, get my chair back from Lynette. I also love the character of Lynette. Absolutely, Jack meeting his match. He's so present and funny. She was the best character that they added in, and just the yeah. dynamic yes. was so just beautiful. And weirdly, way more evolved than he is about living in Toledo and actually embracing life, which I, it's, it's a sneaky little thing that they're doing. I'm not much of a painter, but I did try to paint this periodic table and a little um, adult beverage right there. Somebody used chemistry in order to concoct some sort of a hooch. Exactly, a good old fashioned like bathtub hooch. What is coming out of the bottle? What's that little phrase? So it says, I mean, the kids are old enough to get pregnant. If you were making a drink, you know, really what you're dealing with is chem Have you ever like, oh, he froze. The internet doesn't work, ever. Thank you guys so much for watching the show. I'm excited yeah, for you guys you. for the next season. So excited for season three. All right. See ya. We'll see you guys. Thanks, guys. Bye. Yeah, that was awesome. I mean, Rachel, you did a, a Heather puppet impression <laughs> for Glenn and Patton. I may have peed a little. Who well, wasn't that fun, right? We laughed. We learned. And we saw some really interesting body art. We should talk about that at a later time. Anyway, I'm inspired by that fandom, and I enjoy AP Bio. But for me, there's only one man that inspires that level of devotion and creativity. Al Roker. The Roke. I put a little sun up here because I like to say that, you know, I like to bring a little joy. Um, <laughs> oh my God. Oh, hi. Nice to see everybody. I'm just... So what weather crafts are you doing? This is how I would tell the fortune. Uh, for the weather for the day. Snow, rain, wind, or fog? Snow. Okay, S-N-O-W. <laughs> I took one of these sun shields and I covered it in a crystal mesh so that you can still wear it. It still looks really fantastic. <laughs> wow. Oh. oh my, so it's been like very cloudy and rainy in Jersey and I put a little sun up here because I like to say that, you know, I like to bring a little joy um, when things are cloudy and when things look down. So sometimes the sun has to peek out of the clouds and you know, the damp weather. So. You a driver there in New Jersey? I do drive. Uh, do you use your turn signals? Because every time I get cut off, I don't even have to look. I know the license is from New Jersey. I do. I'm from Jersey. I do. You drive here in Jersey. Wait a minute. <laughs> One, two, three, four. It'll be flood warning, 95% humidity. There you go. A little weather origami. It's a snowstorm in a jar. But the good news is uh, you're doing all this stuff, uh, uh, and you're probably running out of things to do. You know, of course, uh, uh, Peacock. You'll be able to get world-class stuff, great videos, and uh, Today All Day. You can watch the Today Show all day. How many of you actually watch the weather? Because I know a lot of people get their weather off of apps. Oh, that's no, great. I actually watch it. Yeah, I do. Excellent. It's a lot more fun to watch the weather. I Absolutely. like the show. I want to try the green screen thing. And play. A lot of places do not have gotten rid of the green screen. Uh, and the reason for that is, you know, these big screen monitors have gotten so perfect so that it you don't have to worry about the chroma key crinkling on you or anything like that most people use a, a tv monitor that so that means you can wear green i exactly and don't forget today peacock streaming check it out it's on all your smart devices and Bye. Bye. Was anybody expecting that? No. Oh. But we're talking about weather. Why not, right? Yeah. <laughs> that was great. Absolutely. Yeah. He's real down to earth. You can just tell yeah. that. I'd like to have lunch with him. He's yeah, me too. Uh, <laughs> now, all that would be great under any circumstance. And right now, I need me some peacock.